Welcome guys, it's Dave Walker here, excuse my voice, you know, I'm a little bit under the weather, you know, sore throat. Um, Dave Walker Sports, man, let's get right into it, let's talk about Jarvis Landry. He has been released from the Cleveland Browns to clear up the $15 million cap space. Now, I'm telling you guys, I knew that they were, the Browns and Jarvis had an issue. I'm pretty sure the Browns probably really didn't know that they had too much of an issue with Jarvis until Jarvis came out after um, Odell had left and was saying that, you know, his targets was being depleted too. Like, him and Odell both were suffering because they wasn't getting the proper targets. And, you know, that right there was a was an issue with the Browns. Um... So, yeah, you know, with Amari. See, here, here's the thing about Amari. Amari, he's going to play. He's going to put his head down. He's going to play. You just got You pay him his money, he's going to play. As you said. But like I said, his problem that I have with him is it's just the big games. He wasn't there. Not saying he's not a good receiver, but just the big games. I need you, brother. I need you. Now, with being released, the $15 million, Dallas should hop right on that, pay that $15 million. You get a good receiver. With a five million dollar discount, Jerry, you just saved yourself five million right there. So you gotta hop on it. That way you can have your triple threat, your triple threat receiver because Dak gonna need it. Now that was a lot of talks that some people were saying that Zeke should have been the one released because of his production of play. Tony Pollard has emerged. He has. Now to me, with that being said, I think. Jerry is, even though Zeke production has went down, you know, to have the, the running back with the speed and having the power running back, he think that that's a good combo and that Zeke will break out of the funk. But if this is a business and I was running a business, I probably would have let Zeke go. But then also you have to think of that goes with Jerry's pride. If Jerry releases See, Amari wasn't drafted there. Jerry Jones didn't handpick Amari and say that, hey, he's the chosen one out of this draft. Nah. But what Jerry did do that for Zeke. He handpicked Zeke. Just like that. Uh, Dak got his money because it was he was a fan favorite. And a lot of people fought for Dak. You know, but he... He didn't have a hand picking Dak. He, he didn't even want Dak. He won't wince. Now I'm pretty sure he's glad that he didn't get wins. But he got Zeke. That's what he wanted. So, Jerry, you pick up. You pick you pick him up. Um, I'm pretty sure, being a Dallas Cowboy, that you praise that y'all are the number one franchise and that everybody wants to play for Dallas. Hey, you know Jarvis is – He's going to want to play there. You know, he's going to get his 15 mil. And he's with other good receivers with a good defense. He really thinks that he may can give them a shot, help give them a shot to win that championship. He could be the one that take them to the next level. He probably feels that. So, Jerry, I feel like you guys should get on the phone. You should do that. You know, um, but Dallas, Dallas needs – it's crazy too, because when you when you look at Dallas, and you think like Dallas underachieved with the talent they have, so I don't know, really, I don't know what's going on in Dallas. I I just don't know what. I don't I don't know. But guys, tell me what you think. Do you think that Jarvis Landry should be picked up by the Cowboys, or you think he should go somewhere else? Um. Let me know. Just tell me what you guys think about it. And we're out.